Um, lastly, uh, Luisa from uh, Claudia Molina's office is here, so I just want to give her a chance to just say hi. <laughs> Well, good morning, because it's still morning. So uh, my name is Luisa Oyage, and I'm the Senior Legislative Deputy for uh, County Supervisor Gloria Molina. She's a representative for the 1st District that encompasses downtown L.A., the Pico Union area, all the way to Pomona. And that is her population and constituency of 2 million. And I'm here to listen to you, and I know how, what it is like because I, uh, at this age of my life, I'm still the interpreter for my parents, um, and I'm going to, uh, with my dad, to Kaiser to interpret his new prescription um, uh, classes. And Kaiser called me and said, please come with your dad who serve as his interpreter. So I know the pressures of, of, of children as well as parents and growing uh, aging parents, too, when it deals with um, issues of interpretation, uh, language interpretation, etc. And also, I know for a fact that the supervisor is very committed to full access, not only on Korean languages, but all well, minority languages here in Los Angeles County. I know back in 2000, the census reveals that there's a 2% uh, Korean um, spoken language in LA County. And I know in the upcoming census, which is 13 months away, that everybody will make sure that everybody gets counted and fill out the necessary forms in indicating to us about the spoke, um, spoken Korean in your homes. So I'm here to listen and report back to our supervisor because she's very interested in on uh, learning more about your challenges and experiences with all of our county departments. And I know they're doing a good job, but I know we could do more and c could become better. So thank you. Thank you.